way to prevent this coronavirus, man. <laughs> this video will show you a way. I'm pretty sure you can already see a little bit of the, you know, it's just, it's just the first bit of the video is right here. It's obvious what I'm about to show you, but it's a way. It's, it's a way to prevent from catching the coronavirus in case you are scared and you don't want to end up like one of those people who actually have to stay indoors and not being able to go out because they have to do everything under their control to prevent it from catching it. So uh, this video here is one of is one of many solutions that will help us prevent from catching this coronavirus. I'm just gonna go ahead and play it and you will just see what you think. Yup, that's one of many ways you can prevent from catching the coronavirus. What you gotta do is just open the door with the damn food. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty creative. That is a good idea, you know. Many hospitals would need that kind of thing, especially hospitals, yeah. Because you can catch diseases from many sick people out there, especially now that this coronavirus has officially landed in the UK. It's peak, bruv. It's peak. You know what's sad? It's sad that now we have to deal with that. You know what I mean? I don't want to sound too critical, but... These damn Chinese people just eat everything, bruv. You know, no wonder why they caught that fucking coronavirus. I didn't even know what that coronavirus was. Did you see the video that actually went viral? The video of a Chinese person eating a fucking living bat. A living bat, bruv. These guys just go around and eat everything. Dogs, cats, dinosaurs, foxes, rats. To think that these animals are filthy and just go around anywhere. Some of these animals are even eat rubbish. Shit. They got all kinds of sorts of rubbish in them. And Chinese people go around and eat them. And then act surprised because they got a fucking virus. A fucking disease that can pass on to everybody. And now we have to deal with it. We have to deal with it. We stick to eating normal food, bruv. The same animals. Why you have to expand and get creative with the kind of food that you eat? Stick to, see, stick to eating the same meat. Pork. Cow. Chicken. Duck. Yeah? What else? Like, just stick to stick to eating the same meat. Don't go around. Why, why you have to eat all kinds of sorts of animals? One day you just get angry and decide to eat your pet dog. Your snake. It's fine to eat snakes because I don't like snakes. But I wouldn't eat a snake. Fuck that. Fucking eating elephants. Relax. Chinese people, you need to relax. Relax. Not everything is to be ate. Now we gotta do this shit. We might even have to stay indoors and not be able to get out to get out the house because of this bullshit. Coronavirus. What the fuck is that, man? This is scary. It's scary. He's, he's getting everyone scary, man. You know, uh, it's peak, man. But fam, what did these Chinese people got us into, bruv? It, it, it's just mad and, and sad. It saddens me a lot because now we have to go through all, the, all that kind of bullshit. Spoke to my friend recently as well, and he told me that we have to be careful. We can't make any sorts of physical contact with anything and anyone because there's a high possibility that we might catch that shit. Which means that we we pretty much might as well just stay home. If we're going to stay home, I hope we're still going to get paid off our jobs. I hope they're still going to pay us while we're home because we're not going to be able to get out, especially if your job consists of, you know, meeting people, you know, running and just dealing with people every single day. If that's your job, I mean, your possibility, your chances of getting that fucking coronavirus is is, is high. I mean, this video just shows that it's one of many ways that can help us prevent it from happening, from catching this coronavirus, but it's not enough, man. This is not enough. You know what this is also good for? It's good for one of them people go shopping and like to make sure they do a one trip just so they don't have, don't have to go back to the car to get the rest of the bags. I'm one of those people. Like, if I got a lot of bags from shopping, I like to make sure I get everything out of the car. Like, there's nothing else left in the car for me to go back to. 
this is really good, you know what I'm saying? Because my hands, everything, like, just be full. I even put shopping bags on top of my head, on my shoulders, to make sure I don't have to go back. And this is really good, because all I have left is my fucking feet. So if I had those in, on my door, like if I can get those on my door, this will be pretty handy. But then the problem comes if, when I will have to open the door with the damn keys. Because I'm not going to leave my door open just so I can open the door like that and I come back from shopping. Shit. When I, go, when, I go, when I go shopping, that's enough time for them, for anyone to come through to my house and steal everything that's in it. Fucking cause a burglar. Yeah, this is it, guys. I mean, damn, man. These Chinese people just don't, like, they have no chill, man. Eating uh, living animals. And the thing is, they not only eat living animals, they eat it raw, fam. These Chinese people are starting to scare me, bruv. When they run out of animals to eat, yeah, when they figure out that they've ate every single animal on planet Earth, they're going to they gonna want to eat fucking people, bruv. Turn into cannibals and shit. I'm starting to think the Chinese people are not fucking humans. They fucking aliens, bruv. Jeez, man, relax. Not everything is to be eaten, bruv. Like, not everything... Like, you lot need to relax, bruv. Eating every single animal, bruv. Did you know the foxes actually eat rubbish? Foxes eat rubbish. And I believe that these guys go around just eating, leaving fucking foxes raw as well, like that. They don't even peel off the fucking fur. They don't even peel off the fucking fur of the animal. They eat the animal like that with the fur as well. Disgusting, bruv. I wonder why you got corona now. How you got coronavirus and we have to deal with it? Why? No. You know, they're going to fight a lion and a fucking gorilla at the same time just to eat him. They're going to want to eat him alive like that. Shoot him down with a fucking AK or something like that. And then just eat him while, while they dying slow. Just eat him like that. Turn into fucking vampires. Suck the blood out the fucking lion and, and gorilla. Just suck the blood. They turn... They, they, they'll come to a point where they'll turn... <coughs> they'll turn... Animals' blood into fucking juice. They know I act surprised why they got diseases. But they don't be bringing all these diseases from eating all these animals here. We stick to eating the same animals. Chicken. Pork. What else? Pig's feet. Nah, I don't eat pig's feet, but, you know, like, we used to eat chicken feet. You know, that's as far as we go. Duck. What else? Uh... Goat? Yeah? What else? What else is there that we eat? We eat the same animals. That's all you need to know. Yeah? The most important thing is that we eat the same animals. We don't go around eating all kinds of sorts of animals. Bat, dogs, cats, rats. Come on, guys. I mean, damn. Man, these people need to chill, bro. I go as all scared and shit. Scared of this coronavirus, man. There might be a chance I might not even be able to go, to go out. I might not be able to go out just to prevent from catching this coronavirus. I'm just gonna stay in the house all day, doing nothing, watching Netflix, playing the game. That's boring as shit. I need to get out, man. Come on, man. Because wearing all fucking masks and shit, bro. What the fuck? We don't eat those animals. You eat those animals. You deal with the disease. Why do we have to deal with it? That's wrong, man. But this is a way to prevent from happening, you know. You know, um... Yeah. You will have to put this on every door of any shop and, 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 and hospitals and fucking houses everywhere, bro. Yeah, man. Uh, this is what I wanted to show you. You know, uh, one of one of the ways, one of many ways you can prevent this coronavirus. Uh, just stay safe out there, man. You know, stay safe because this coronavirus is actually bringing a little threat, a little 
or big threat to the world. I don't know, man. Shit is scary. There are some things about it and still trying to figure out what to do. But this is one of the things you can do. But yeah, man, this is the end of the video, man. You know, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend if you want him to stay safe. And yeah, I'll catch you next time, man. In a bit.